Good morning, you guys. I am back at the gym. I haven't worked out in over two weeks. Do you see the light spot on my head? I don't know where this came from, but something that the sun did to me, and I don't know what the deal is with it, but we're here. It's gonna be a little bit of a rough one today because I have not moved my body like this in a hot minute. I played soccer with my nieces and nephews, but I have not done deadlifts. I have not done any type of hip thrust, RDL, anything like that, and I feel like this is a little bit of a difficult time is just like getting back into the routine of working out. I have a new pre-workout with me today. It actually launches today. Libby it's rocket pop and then they also are releasing the energy drinks that match this I'm gonna dump this in here this scoop looks like it's a little bit bigger my greens creatine and then that one scoop of pre-workout in here I'm gonna drink real quick <gasps> my hair always does this it's a good workout I don't think it was like the best workout but I think that you have to kind of like overcome that little obstacle of getting back into the gym in order to have like those great amazing workouts so glad that I made it I'm glad that I did it I'm about to head to Jeep so they can service my car for me I think I might grab like a little starbies on the way there i have just a couple of minutes let me tell you these gas prices <laughs> florida florida's a bit worse i will say i won't lie that extra coin don't hurt but i guess money baby i just rather spend yours first you know i'm doing my hair right now in my Sherpa hoodie blanket. I just wanted to check in. So I'll see ya when I have my hair done. Thank you. I know. I know. I'm shocked too. The way that I can just like be presentable some days is terrifying. On this bodysuit, everybody was asking where the brown one was from. From Davis Active. They have this open back. Super cute. And I just love the cream one. Some laundry done and then I want to go outside because it's quite literally burning up out there, love. 87 degrees. I belong outside. It's time for a little snacky snack. I have some toast and some avocados. And they're actually delicious. They look delicious at least. I accidentally like threw the pit of this on the floor. This went on live for a little bit and that was a good time. Still moment. I am about to go outside and get in a swimsuit because it's 87 degrees outside and there's no way I'm missing this sun and this heat. Now what we do next is we add a little bit of balsamic glaze, some everything but the bagel seasoning. Let me grab it. Look at her. Oh, are you kidding me right now? Are you joking? JJ and I had gone to dinner. We went to Longhorn and got some food. I put on a new fit. I don't know if I'm gonna even be able to show you this. This was the fit for Longhorn. Little Lulu skirt has shorts underneath and then I have the Adapt Animal crop on and I just like folded it over a little bit. She was cute. Then we went to the mall and I got more shoes. What else is new? Can I show them to you? Not shoes that I typically would get, but we actually were getting them for like our nephew for his birthday today. He turned 10. And I was like, wait, I like them because they're neutral. And then JJ was like, okay, let's get them. And I was like, okay, deal. An hour, lovely. Up tempos. I don't even know what they're called. Yeah, they're up tempos. Nike Air. Look at them. Aren't they kind of nifty? I feel like I could wear them with like bodysuits and stuff. They used to be ugly to me. Yeah, I used to think that these were ugly, but I feel like the nude and like this little camel color kind of kind of gave me a new perception of it. I need to read some more of my book. I started Regretting You by Colleen Hoover. It's been months since I've read. I did get my car windows tinted. Got my front ones done just to match the back. It's not, shh, it, don't tell anybody, but it's not legal. I have to buy new shoe containers from the container store because I'm literally out and you guys know I have a shopping for shoes problem. Golden Hour is just like slapping right now. Good morning, I am drinking my greens and creatine. It's literally late in the day for me to go to the gym. Like, I feel like usually if I haven't woken up, gone to the gym at this point in the day, I'm probably just like, okay, well, it's a rest day. But I really wanna work out today. I have shoulders, so I'm wearing the new triangle ombre shorts, and then I have just a v-neck training bra. It's literally 9.01. I feel like I was just taking my time today, and 
allowing myself to have a little bit of a slower morning. Just had a really delicious little parfait. It's like my fixation food. Vanilla Greek yogurt with blueberries. And I usually like jar my blueberries and my strawberries. It actually keeps them for up to two times longer than if it was stored in plastic. So also add some granola to it, honey, and some almond butter. I can't find the maple almond butter that I had when I was in Florida. You guys, it is 12 a.m. It's midnight. I just finished packing all of my goods for the morning time. Bronx is literally in bed. He can't be bothered right now. And I'm gonna go to sleep for literally like two hours because we're leaving at like 3 a.m. My stomach's growling, but we're gonna get on the road soon to get to Florida. Good night. Well, 3.17 and we're ready to go. We're hitting the road. JJ's got everything packed up. Let's go. This portion of the video is sponsored by Billy. Billy is a female first body and shave brand that provides all of the goodies that you might need to get the closest shave possible. In a recent Q&A, I was actually asked what type of hair removal I use. And I'm a simple girl. I just like to shave. Billy razors are super sharp and they come with a magnetic magic holder. This magnet comes with a little putty on the back so you're able to easily just throw it onto your shower wall. And after that, you have your magnet and your razor that just sticks right on. Here I'm using the starter kit, which comes with a magnetic holder, a starting razor and blade and a spare blade. This ended up coming right in time for me to prep for my trip to Florida and it had me feeling like a smooth little dolphin in the ocean. Absolutely loved it but if you guys would like to pick up your own starter kit from Billy you can click the link in the description below. And thank you so much to Billy for sponsoring this portion of the video. We came and it was a long journey, but it was a good journey. And then we went and hung out with JJ's family for a hot minute last night. And then we finally got to our Airbnb. We're gonna have greens creatine and look at the water. Is my hair giving Florida? No, I've really been into my little like plastic parted look lately, but this is where all of my swimsuits are. Pack and packing cubes. Yes, it's not a flex. It's just the reality, okay? All my stuff and my shoes like in this closet back here. But there's so many to choose from. I think I'm gonna get crispy. I do like this one a lot. I tried this one on TikTok. It is out there with the boys. So we brought two of our friends, by the way. Savage and Cookie. My dad was like, are those dogs? And I said, that's a really good question rice but it's not close but they're humans this is my before getting some in florida look this is the suit i'm going with she's a wee bit cheeky but that's my vibe i got this from amazon and then i have this little cover-up it's like my little potato sack pretty sure sid had this but i was like oh i'm going to the beach that'll be perfect so it just ties on the sides but it's open back and it's like not woven but you can kind of see the type of material it is sleep outside and apparently there was a shark it was so hectic so chaotic it really wasn't and i had no idea this is disappointing i decided to come back upstairs and i couldn't use a little shower because it wouldn't turn on so i have sand on me still here's the update oh my gosh i dropped my banana you know what i just need to take a break i know i was gonna eat the other side of it am i crispy I'm gonna eat some food and bananas and just not this one. Entourage, you know. We had some good food though. We're really not part of the party right now. 
Cause everybody's outside the car, but there's bugs out there. And candies in here. Yeah. He says, is your vlog camera good? It's on me. It's on me. I think I got a little bit of sun. I think you can tell a little bit. I feel like my hair got lighter, which obviously happens in the sun. Everybody's asleep except for me because I had Gymshark launch that I went live for and then I also just got off of a call and it's only nine o'clock. So I've been up for a couple of hours and if you can't hear it already, motorcycles everywhere. I guess this weekend is Thunder Beach. So it's like this huge motorcycle thing where all kinds of bikers just come and hang out at the beach and they do their thing thizzle. I wanna go to a couple of the stores out here. I wanna get some like groceries so I can have some yummy delicious food and then I also I'm gonna go to Starbucks get some goodies and it's already 76 degrees outside it's 9 in the morning so I will be heading to the beach immediately and I need to grab like some stuff so I don't burn because I had just a little bit of some SPF and I got a little toasty yesterday so I couldn't tell you what the bun is right now but I just got a couple of tank tops that were three dollars at Walmart and then a pair of joggers because when we go back to chipley at night it always gets a little bit chilly for me and i also got a couple t-shirts and then 70 spf sunscreen and some aloe because i know my shoulders are going to be a wee bit tender and a little bronzy it's only been one day we're gonna go to fresh market they have like a lot of good produce and i just want to get some food from there I get my normal order, right? Grande light iced oat milk latte with brown sugar syrup and caramel drizzle cold foam. So good. This looks oddly darker than my usual. I'm gonna try it together, but I also wanna put this on my story. Yeah, this is not my drink. This is like mocha. Hope this is okay. It's like chocolate milk. This is thick, this is dense. It's a little sad. I thought it looked weird. Head down. Here's the suit. But I love this cover up. I think that it's so cute. I had socks on because I was just wearing tennis shoes. So I'm gonna head down there. The sun was playing a second ago. I didn't want to come out, but now clouds are gone. So JJ's not sleeping. He's not asleep. I grabbed him his coffee, but it's gonna be cold. <laughs> update went swimming and it was magnificent this is this is what i look like right now the tea is that i am now crispy i got this on amazon two days before we left okay it's from billabong i'll link it on my storefront down below it's okay though so how many people did you get content for it looks like beer I don't know why I was expecting it to taste like ramen noodle packet. One, we're gonna get some crab legs and then we're gonna go to Pier Park. Yes. Good morning. All right, I'm in the elevator um, going down right now. Okay, you guys, Starbies did redeem themselves today and they gave me this drink for free, so that was lovely of them. Now, there's a task that is being put upon me. First of all, I have to grab five bags, I have two drinks. And I also bought this at the store. I got a beach volleyball. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just clean. You don't want to hit this? You don't want to hit this? Have you heard that? And you mean to tell me? You don't want to hit this?
this here is the fit. The triangle ombre is actually on the side already. This is what I went to go shoot for. If you want to get them, definitely do. I think I'm wearing these in a size extra small, but I would recommend maybe sizing up if you're between. It's very similar to all of the other ombre colors. It's a little bit more compressive. I have a v-neck training bra on and my Converse. And typically when I get to the gym, I always have a workout planned. I don't know what I want to do today, so I'm writing one. Shoulders, mm, this is how it is for me. I don't have it already written, then I take a little bit to actually get it together. You know what I mean? Hmm. Oh God. Oh God. That's so far away. Oh God. Okay. My pre-workout was literally in West Hell, Egypt. Okay, I went to Sprouts because we needed some turkey bacon. We just go through eggs and bacon so quickly here. I act like it's a whole family, it's me and JJ. Three packs of the butcher shop bacon, and then I also got myself some turkey burgers because I went to the other store the other day and they didn't have my turkey burgers. Got whole dates. I prefer whole dates over pitted dates. So something about pitted dates, they're already like kind of dry. Two lemons for when I make little salads and then also avocado toast. And then I also finally found the almond butter that I had in Florida. Do so you want to check it out? So it is base culture maple almond butter and it's delicioso. But yeah, look at the shoulders. Ah. It's fa time. The winter sun is going down. Look at it. Good morning. I am about to head to the gym. It's like 7.30 right now. I'm working out with Mr. Ed today and joining him in his little personal training session. These older ombre um, like seamless shorts and then just a white roost training bra. My white 270s. I have my hair in a braid. I've got some snacks. I'm ready to go. Listen to me right now. I was not prepared. I have sweat literally drying under my eyes. Uh, hold on. I just did this workout with Mr. Ed and a man named Carl. Love them both. And when I tell you that I think that I was resurrected, I think they had a GTA revive me or Call of Duty revive me. I don't even know. sandwich i know you see this bagel it's about to slap to lap so hard mm. back up back up bro all right you guys it's been a few days since i last checked in with you guys i've just been on the move getting things done jj and i got bikes we went on a bike ride we went to look at some yesterday and went to go visit my aunt and uncle but i just wanted to close off this vlog because i know it was a little bit chaotic basically i took you through a week in my life or some days in my life and inside of this vlog you guys watched a snippet of my florida vlog so thankful to billy razors for sponsoring this video so make sure you guys check them out i'll have a link in the description box if you guys did enjoy this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up also be sure to subscribe so you guys don't miss another video with me so you guys can keep up with me every single day on instagram at libby christensen but yeah thank you guys again for watching i hope you enjoyed it i'll see you guys next time and I'll talk to you guys later.